All right, guys, welcome to Dark Fracture. This is an older Dark Fracture than the other Dark Fracture that we Dark Fractured before. This game contains strong language and gruesome content that some players might find disturbing. Certain scenes may potentially trigger seizure for people with photosensitivity epilepsy. Player discretion is advised. Okay, guys, so like I said, this is the Dark Fracture before the Dark Fracture that we Dark Fractured twice when we dark fractured uh anyway it's an older one it's not the one with the hands coming out of the wall and all the assets this is an older one so it shouldn't have all the assets um you know let's skirt out our options just to see what we got you know let's see if there's anything fuck borderless borderless is for pussies nobody should ever lose borderless okay um frame limit unlimited of course we're gonna gamble this up because you know dark ass games right all right graphics quality ultra 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 let's see if there's any anti-aliasing because that's but what stupid people do? Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, if you use anti-aliasing, you are stupid. I just called you out. Okay, so that looks pretty good. Uh, you know, I, I can get behind that. Okay, let's go back. Go audio, master, yeah, music. Let's turn on the music. The music's stupid. All right, if you listen to music, full blast, you're stupid. All right. And uh, control, let's, let's check it out. What do we got? What do we got? What key binding? Let's, let's see. Uh, left mouse and okay, shift, jump, space bar, crouch, all right, inventory, lighter, camera, zoom, throw physics, T, rotate physics, R. All right, cool. All right, you know what? I feel pretty confident with this. Let's go, guys. Give me a like, comment, subscribe, click me a little bell, all that good shit, and let's go. Dark Fracture Prologue is meant to be completed in a single session. If you quit mid-game, all progress will be lost. His broken mind leaked his fractured soul into the dark, endless labyrinth. In the eternal night, he longed for the respite from the loneliness, only to realize he had never really been alone. As I awoken from my drunken <sighs> slumber, why do you have a onesie on your freaking the wall? Long I out. Oh, I need a cigarette. Where's my damn lighter? Dark night. Ding, 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 ding. Okay, it is a Unity game, but uh, this was before they learned how to not change anything in games. What is this? You throw. Throw it. Yeet! Okay, throwing sucks. It doesn't work. Lies. Yeet! You just right click. It's easier. Yeet! Need a lighter to make that work. Daddy? Theodore, he was left behind on a car seat in a cab seven years ago by a passenger before me. His enigmatic smile caught my eye, and we have been best friends ever since. He does not say much, but he's a great listener. I always wonder what he's looking at. This dude looks like he's high as a fucking kite. Just letting you know. High. Like, very. Wow, am I going to really have to search this whole damn place for my lighter? Like, I mean... The guy's obviously a smoker. You'd think he knew where his damn lighter is. DMCA. What is this? Get stuff. Plastic potato chips. Okay. Keep those in a drawer open, why don't you? All right, this guy's been uh, chasing the dragon. What is this? I don't know what that is. Fuck that. That's not something. What we're 
looking for a lighter. Tijeras. Cerveza. Taza de café. It's jam. Why is it not jellied? Because you can't. What the fuck? Shut that stuff off. What is this? Amethystine, personal medication. My psychiatrist tells me it's used for severe mental illness that do not improve. I've been consuming these for several years now. Common side effects which I'm experiencing are drowsy, low blood pressure, blurred vision, and dizziness. Okay. They misspelled the mentazine for licensing reasons, most likely. What was in here that triggered... And triggered it. This one's j -j jam. Right, can we open all these two? Martaro. I smoke about a pack of these daily, and I truly do not believe you can work here unless you're a heavy smoker. It's a habit. And whenever I manage to visit the town, I buy as many as I can since this facility is so isolated. But hey, at least they're cheap. Wow. Pussy. Gotta smoke some filtered cigarettes. You ain't smoking filterless screws. You don't know what you're doing. Is that the lighter or is that a stapler? Where the hell did this guy's lighter go? Oh, we got keys. Key to the office. Give me that. That's the office key. Now, where's my lighter? That, that's what I was saying. Tab to examine this. Found the key after my last cigarette. I left the lighter inside of my locker in the changing room. My colleague Norman was being his usual insufferable self, and I just could not deal with this bullshit anymore. So I went for a smoke break and left my lighter behind. I should go grab it. Ah, change your room. Okay. Most doors and drawers are interactive. Some of these are locked. It can be opened by a specific key. All right. Where's that jammed one? in here. Maybe I should turn the lights on. What the fuck? How? What is this shit? Where the hell do I work? Five guys? It's jam. Not jellied. It's jam. Not marmalade. Jam. I would rather smoke than check in on dead bodies. Dude, I really am curious where you fucking work. Autopsy room. I've got no business going in there. Here you do. The key to my locker. It's old and rusty. I've always wondered how many people have held it before me. How many of them have stuck it in their prison pocket before you? Yeah. My locker key. I'm gonna slide it on my office keychain. What do this say? Specimen report is a very interesting case. She's still up there in one of the outdoor cages. I will need to check on all of them when the rainstorm passes. What the heck? Oh, this is quite a changing room. The changing room is such a mystery. So many former employees left their belongings behind and never came back to collect them. It's almost as if they did not know where they if they were coming back or where the real big hurry is. It's weird either way. Anyway, I got to check my locker. 
Do we have a name tag? Name tags would be... Is there anybody naked in here that I can spy on? That'd be awesome. Sweet home. Oh, okay. Exit key. I will definitely get. Wait, a key for the exit door leading to the body farm upstairs. I've got a long shift to go, so I cannot think about leaving just yet. Lighter? The lighter is a useful secondary source of light. Oh crap, I almost forgot about the pill. Take the pill there, watching? What do that mean? I need to take the Oxidata pill from my locker. It's a small, shady looking red and white capsule. I've got plenty more upstairs, not that I ever want to take any more of these, and I need to consume them daily if I want to continue working here. Part of the rule book. Yo, that looks like a fucking football to me. If you guys don't know what a football is, look it up. But <laughs> this shift's going to be fun. Facility medication. The administration here requires all staff to consume this pill daily. With strangely specific directions. The claim the pill is for staying mentally alert on the job and the daily ritual centers our thoughts and focuses the mind or something to that effect. Ah. Well, I better do it the way they asked. Because with all these cameras around, it feels like they're watching my every move. Sometimes I feel like somebody's watching me. Tito! Alright, I just dated myself. If you guys don't know who Tito is, then, you know. Time for my daily dose. Okay, I took my daily dose. Daily dose. Am I supposed to change my clothes or something? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Right here. Edward, by the time you read this, I would no longer be in your life. I have changed my phone number, taken my belongings, and will be staying in a hotel for a short while. I left your keys on the desk. I won't be needing them anymore. I just cannot watch you do this. I love you, Edward. I still love you. And that is exactly why I can't stomach seeing this. Press E to continue reading. What? Oh. <clears throat> um, I can't help you if you fight me at every turn, and I won't stand by while you destroy yourself and destroy us. I know I'm being selfish. I know this must hurt. But I'm hurting too, and no matter how many times we spoke, my words never reach you. I'm sorry it has to be this way, but I know that if I tried saying goodbye in person, I would change my mind. So before that happens, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Bitch, couldn't even use freaking proper punctuation? Consulting. This wallet was given to me as a gift. It is loaded with memories, some good, and a few I'd rather not look at. Cynthia. Ugly ass wallet. Any bathhouse beauties in here? Oh no, you did not just blow my shit out. Ah! Oh! Someone puked on the floor. Hello? Any hot ladies in here? ¿En dónde está, señoritas caliente? Not that I'm perverted or anything, I'm just saying. Hmm. Lighter won't light up. The lighter won't light up. Well, shit. I don't need 
light up anyway. I'm going this way. Huh. Hello. Oh, it's cleaning supply. Wrenches. Like a good idea. Let's mess with this. Oh, I guess we don't get to. That's fine. I didn't want to anyway. Hello. This is the last photo of James that I took. It brings up so many memories. I really miss him. Dude, the shakes must have been kicking in. We got the DTs or some shit. I don't know. Pretty crazy. Hmm. Time for my deal. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Wait, 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 I fucked up. It said time for my daily dose. I didn't read what it said. I think I fucked up. Because it says, day after day, I stopped caring about what this dubious medication is for. After all, I'm still alive. As for the side effects, well, I cannot really tell because it's not like I've always been stable to begin with. What's odd is that they strictly require me to consume it in front of the bathroom mirror. I wish someone would tell me what that was about. Oh, okay. We haven't done that. I'm just going to skip the pill tonight. We'll no. see what happens. No, we're not, we're not going to take it away. Many paranormal events will occur throughout Dark Fracture. Your sanity will begin to sink. Your actions will also affect your sanity. Try to preserve it through time. Okay, listen. I had the pill! Screw this. I've thrown it away. I guess we'll see if they will even notice I did not take the daily dose. Going to smoke in the aisles of the storeroom there. There's a step stool and an ashtray I left on them. My secret spot is one of the only places I've not recorded by the cameras. I can always chill while smoking there. Okay, well, you know... I was in the bathroom. I was literally about to take the pill. Wait. Where the hell are my cigarettes? Oh, God, you're an idiot. Seriously, what the hell is this? Weird valve handle. I don't remember it ever being here. Damn, I missed the phone call. It might have been important, and someone is probably going to come in to check on me. I better get busy. From what I recall, there are six bodies occupying the freezers in the freezer room. 
A routine checkup is in order. I still got a few more hours to spend here until my shift ends. But when I'm done, I should also check in on the decom decomposition process in the outdoor cages. I don't like what he's doing with his life, but I really needs to get it in order. Okay, my cigarettes are right there, but why come I can't take them? Put the ugly kid photo down and give me my smoke. Where are my smokes? Smoke. Okay, so I guess I can't smoke. Okay, so we need to go to the freezer. I don't know where the hell the freezers are. No, this is an elevator. That wasn't too hard. Freezers A3, A5, B8 should all be occupied. It will only take a minute to do a reaching check on them. Hopefully the rainstorm will continue. I really don't feel like checking on decomposition on the outdoor cages. Okay. A5, B8, B11, B13. Hello? Hello, sir? Are you dead? A5 looks dead. Hello, sir? Are you dead? Okay. B8 looks dead. Routine checkup, sir. B11, are you dead? B11 looks dead. Housekeeping, are you dead? Looks dead. is missing from the freezer. Fuck, I'd better use the office phone to report this immediately. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, there could be someone walking around with a body. That'd be fucked up, especially if it wasn't Halloween. Or roleplay a night for sex night. Maybe he thinks he's being real funny, but I don't. Who the fuck was that on the line? I, I can't deal with this bullshit right camera now. Camera shutter clicking away, but where's it coming from? Camera shutter. The phone line is dead, and this shift is getting very strange. I'm hearing unfamiliar sounds coming from the far side of the morgue. 
a body is missing, and strange objects disappear out of nowhere. But I'm sure there's a logical explanation. Time to investigate where these noises are coming from. Hey, who's there? Set your ass on fire. What in the world? This body should be. This is messed up. That's the missing body bag. It's now on the autopsy table. If this is Norman's idea of a prank, I'm gonna fucking kill him. Well, at least I found it, so that's one less thing to explain, but I can't decide if the door opened by itself or I imagined it, and what's causing these light flashes. I better find out. This camera is often used to photograph the deceased during an autopsy and document the progress of the decomposition. It has a bright flashlight attached. The camera flash can be used as an unlimited light source. Press 2 to equip your camera. Hold it to use the flash. Shit. Bruh. The camera shutter was triggering itself. Something must be wrong here. Why are there a bunch of tampons over there? Was that? Hello? Oh, oh, shit! Now what? Power's fucked. These box should be in the storeroom. Ma'am? Did everything come out alright? Okay, I'll come back later. I got some mirror locks in the storeroom. If you need it. Where the hell am I? Ah, oh, hell. Jeez, look at the size of those things. It reminds me of my freaking dorm room. What is this? It's just like some phlegm or something. Or maybe someone me melted a bunch of dots down. Uh, okay. Yeah, this is happening. Hopefully all the emergency lights are working now. I should locate my medication quickly. The emergency lights are on. They don't provide much illumination and only operate in small parts of the facility, but it's better than nothing. Now that I can at least see where I'm going instead of groping around in the dark, this is a good chance to go grab my medication. It's kept on the cabinet in the office. Good Zippo, man. That's at least a freaking maybe a three, three mark. Uh, okay. You know it's fine. Oh, that is that is, that is not the office. Uh, okay. This is happening. Together, 
can get through this. This isn't real. You're gonna squish my nuts and I'm gonna be very upset. right there I'm praying all these strange things will stop of happening but I've got a creeping feeling in my gut that this madness is here to stay for a while I'm screwed seems like it bruh what the hell Stand in the doorway. Okay, fuck it. I'm getting out of here. The exit key is in my locker. the key. I saw it here. Hello? Yo, I know that sound. My dad used to whoop my ass a lot. Okay. Chain. The key for the exit door leading to the body farm upstairs. What's it doing attached to the ceiling by some chain? This shit ain't funny anymore. Okay. Nope. So at least I found the key. I'm getting out of this fucked up place right now. This is just absurd. The key was... This is just absurd. The exit key was tied to some chain I've never seen before, and everything here is getting weirder by the minute. I need a game plan. I'm going upstairs to report this crazy night from my living quarters. I'm definitely not sticking around for the aftershock. James is locked here before. And the door handle, it's just gone. Well, shit. Oh, thank you. Can you let me in? What on earth is going on? 
These dark wet trails look a lot like blood. I'm pretty sure I don't want to know where they lead to, but since it seems like I'm stuck here anyway, I don't think I'd want just the things to happen or all around me. I think I should investigate and find out where these trails lead to. Smart. I would do the same. shift is seriously testing my limits i don't understand where the blood trails are coming from but some of them seem to lead to this pipe maybe the valve handle that fell on the floor here has something to do with it hopefully if it's returned it where it belongs the madness will stop logic In the oh, okay, this is such a terrible idea. Oh, wonderful! I lost my mind. Where am I? Yep. Is that you? Okay, time to go, homie. Time to go. Hello? What the? This must be a nightmare. What the hell is going on?
It was pretty good. Yep. Pretty good. 